Hi, my name is Jared and I'm the Web3 Prof. I'm quickly going to talk to you just about some common misconceptions that we see in crypto. The first common misconception that I'm going to talk about today is the fact that people believe that cryptocurrencies are really only for those who are tech savvy. Now, you don't need to be tech savvy in order to get into crypto. Now, there is an element of technology that you do need to understand in order to buy and sell crypto, in order to create a wallet and things like that. However, these concepts and these te these pieces of technology have a much better user experience that they did in the early days of Web3. So it is no longer required that you have to be a developer or a computer programmer or a coder to get into this space. A lot of the technology has advanced and there's a much, po much more positive user experience than there was just a couple of years ago. I'll give you an example. If you were to go use a phantom wallet right now uh, to, to store your crypto, it's a decentralized wallet. The user experience is actually really excellent. It's fairly simple. Uh, it's fairly straightforward. But for those of you who are worried about the, the ideas that you're not tech savvy enough to get into crypto, that's why people like me offer courses so I can teach you and help you uh, and hold your hand as you walk along the journey of maybe buying your first portion of a Bitcoin, something we call a Satoshi. Um, also, we see that people of all walks of life are engaging in crypto, especially people in developing countries. Um, there's a low cost of international payments used in crypto for you to transfer money to maybe your relatives in a foreign country to support them financially is very, very affordable. And it's also very simple. And so we see huge numbers of people doing exactly that rather than using organizations like Western Union or bank transfers, um, engaging in crypto transfers in this way. Also, cryptocurrencies are being integrated into everyday products, uh, such as payment solutions. There's all kinds of different organizations now that are offering crypto payment solutions, which is super exciting. And also, cryptocurrencies have gained widespread attention, widespread adoption. Now, it's not that we are in a place of mass adoption yet, but there are lots of different reasons to use it. And because of this uh, increasing level of adoption that we've seen, the experience for the user has become much more positive and much simpler. So uh, the, the user experience has shifted. And so you don't have to be tech sa savvy. You do need to be enthusiastic. You do need to be able to put in a little bit of time to learn. And I hope you'll join me on one of my upcoming Crypto Foundations courses where I teach you all of these types of things. You can check out the web3prof.com or in the comments below in which we'll give you some details on how you can get involved. Thank you and I hope to see you soon.